What's going on guys, Brad here. We just got done doing legs. We're doing hamstrings, glutes, and calves. Pretty short little workout, but a good one. Um, but it was funny, we were just talking about what music we both listen to, me and Lindsay, when we're doing cardio. And it was like completely opposite. I like to listen to like a, a nice slow, I like my station on Pandora is Black Mill. Like that's, that's what I listen to. It gets me in this like nice kind of daydreamy type feel and gets me through the workout. I hate doing cardio, so I kind of have to like woo daydream and just go into another world when I do cardio. And then I'm like, well, what do you listen to, babe? She, she was listening to my music. We were just playing it. She's like, that's so slow. I would fall asleep. I'm like, what do you listen to? So she's been listening to like... It's like what? pop workout music, but yeah. it, like they up the... Beat. They change the beats around in the background, but it's a pop song, so it still has like the lyrics a part of it. And yeah. then I, sometimes I'll add extra singers as like the little. She w she's like, <laughs> she played her station. It was Nicki Minaj, and she's like, I'm a bad bitch. Like, yeah, that's why I'm working out. She's like, I'm a bad bitch. This is why I'm working out. <laughs> uh, anyways, and, we want to. And it's on Slacker, which is better than. It's Pandora. on Slacker Radio. She likes Slacker Radio. I listen to Pandora, so we want to know what music do you guys listen to and i know my channel is mostly mostly guys so ask your girlfriends what they listen to when they're uh, working out and i've got two different style of music so when i'm doing cardio i have to go into my own little daydreamy world so it's like blackmail more kind of like a trancey dubstepy type music but then if i'm doing a really heavy gnarly workout he like by country. myself no <laughs> hell no not country <laughs> Country is like only if I'm in the car with her. <laughs> but um, I don't really have anything against country music. But I listen to, if I'm by myself working out and I need to be doing some heavy ass deadlifts or something, I'll throw on some like corn or slipknot or something super gnarly, like disturbed and just like something to piss me off and get really angry. <laughs> and then I've got my like relaxing kind of just trancey type music that probably fairies listen to <laughs> i don't know i like it. it puts me in a whole different world so we want to know what do you listen to when you're doing cardio and then when you're just doing your regular workout because i want to know and she wants to know from the girls yeah i want to know yeah we need some some new fresh music yeah, anyways station. put the station yeah it's station if it's on pandora or slacker just let us know the, the station and the name of like your favorite songs in the comments section below. But here's the workout we just did. Uh, enjoy and remember to subscribe to the channel and leave those comments with your favorite music. All right, see you guys. All right guys, so I started out the workout with stationary lunges. Um, I used, the first set was a warm up, and then I did three sets with an 80 pound barbell. Um, so these are weighted stationary lunges. One thing you wanna remember with this exercise is try to make sure when you step forward that you're stepping forward far enough to where your knee isn't going further forward than your toe, okay? You wanna make basically a 90 degree angle with your knee and that'll prevent any injuries and make sure that you're stepping straight out in front of you, um, not out to the side too much. Um, and that's gonna really build your glutes and your hamstrings as well as your quads and it also works your calf. So this is a full leg workout. So four sets of the stationary weighted lunges. Next one we're doing here, don't say that I'm doing a deadlift with bad form. This is called a Romanian deadlift or a straight legged deadlift. Basically what you wanna do, you wanna have your legs shoulder width apart. You wanna have a slight, just a very slight bend in your knee a nice straight back, okay? No arching your back on this one. And you wanna just go all the way down to 90 degrees so you're basically parallel with the floor. And then use your hamstrings. As soon as you feel that stretch in your hamstrings, come back up and use the hamstrings to pull the weight up. So you're gonna do four sets with that. I was just using a 45 pound plate on each side. Next exercise we did were uh, four sets of 20 repetitions on calf raises. 
and these are a great one um, if you don't have this machine at your gym a lot of gyms have the ones where you're using um, there's weight on your shoulders and then if you don't have that what you can do is you can just go on a leg press machine and put your toes all the way down to the, the bottom edge and just put some weight on there and make sure you're going all the way down to where you start feeling the muscle contract in your shins and then all the way up pointing your toes to where you get a full contraction with your calves. Next exercise are the Bulgarian split squats. These ones will work your quadriceps, your glutes, as well as your inner thighs. You're pushing up the weight with your, your single leg, so this is a killer exercise. You can see I just have 25 pound plates on each side, and you can do this either with dumbbells, barbells, or the Smith machine like I'm doing. And again, make sure you step far enough forward to where your knees aren't going further past your toes, okay? Try and make a 90 degree angle with your knees on this one as well. This is a killer exercise and it will build a lot of strength in your legs. Again, like the other ones, four sets on this one and I was getting 10 repetitions on each leg. I finished off today's workout with single arm kettlebell swings. And this is a great exercise for working both your quadriceps and your glutes as well as a full body exercise that gets your heart rate up and will burn a lot of fat, okay? I did 10 repetitions with each arm and then I switched and I did three rounds of that. So that was a nice way to end the workout. Got my heart rate up a little bit, get that furnace going and burn some fat. It was just a good way to end the workout today. So I hope you like this workout, you guys. Make sure you do these exercises to where you're hitting the back of your legs as well. You need to work your glutes, your hamstrings, not just your quadriceps. That way you're building a solid, uh, well-rounded leg. You're not gonna get any injuries that way. As always, thanks for watching. I hope you like this workout. Um, make sure that you leave the comments with your favorite music down below and subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time.